This video provides an overview of F5 declarative onboarding, often referred to as DO. Declarative onboarding is a part of the F5 automation tool chain that includes AS3, telemetry streaming, and more. See clouddocs.f5.com for more information on Big IP extensibility. So what is declarative onboarding? As its name suggests, DO is a declarative method for initially configuring a Big IP device with all of the required settings to get up and running. This includes system settings such as licensing and provisioning, network settings such as VLANs and self-IPs, user account settings, clustering settings if you're using more than one Big IP, and more. It does not configure application service objects like virtual servers and pools. That's AS3's job. A declarative model means you provide a JSON declaration rather than a set of imperative commands. The declaration represents the configuration which DO is responsible for creating on a Big IP. You send a declaration file using a single REST API call. Like AS3 and other components of the F5 automation toolchain, this method of onboarding a Big IP is built for automation and orchestration unlike some of the traditional configuration methods. And DO can easily be integrated into existing CI-CD toolchains. Now let's take a look at DO in action. First, here's our brand new Big IP. We've already installed DO, see the documentation for instructions, but otherwise it only has a management IP. Notice there's no license, and it has the default host's name. Now we switch over to Postman. It's already set up at the declarative onboarding endpoint and basic auth to the big IP. Again, see the documentation for details. This declaration is from the documentation examples and is covered in detail there, but some things to notice. There's a license class with our BYOL license reg key, a number of other classes like DNS and NTP, an updated password for the root account and a couple of new users, a provision class with both LTM and DNS provisioned, and some self-IPs and VLANs. If you're not familiar with these terms, see the Big IP and DO documentation. Links are in the description. Once the declaration is complete, you post the declaration by clicking Send. Because onboarding a Big IP isn't instantaneous, you see a status of running and a message of processing. The onboarding process can take a couple of minutes, so here we switch to a GET request, to the same endpoint to get the status, and now we can see the success message. Let's take a quick look at the Big IP system and see what was created. First, we look at the system settings and see the host name was updated. Now we can see the NTP servers and the DNS settings from the declaration are now on the Big IP. We can check to make sure the system is licensed. and the new users that we specified have been added. We can check the provisioning settings and see that both LTM and DNS are provisioned as we specified. And finally, we can check the network settings and see the self-IP and VLANs are also present. This is just a sample of what DO can do. See the DO documentation for more details and visit the declarative onboarding repo on GitHub to download DO. Clickable links are in the description.